Hey everybody, it's um, it's me, Kidney Kane, and in today's video, we'll be crap try to snatching this super glued plane. I'll get to that in a minute, but first, I'm gonna want to talk a little bit about what's going on with my plane crash series. So, if you want to just watch the whole, just the crashing part of this video. I put the time that it starts in the description, so just go to that time if you just want to see the crash and not the message. But I do want to say that, yes, if you haven't seen my community tab, I am ending my plane crash series, my Lego plane crash series, which is because of many reasons, mostly because of obsession. <laughs> And problems taking over my life so that's one of the reasons there's many more but I'm not gonna go through all of those I do want to also say that I will keep I won't do like a crash videos but I am gonna do emergency landing videos like remember how I used to do like oh Air Canada 143 in Lego or whatever but I'm still gonna do that another thing I want to go over is yes in my live stream I did show my face so why am I wearing a mask? Well, it was an accident. I didn't mean to show my face in my live stream. Um, I deleted it since then because I only show my face because there was a problem with the computer, which made it so, puddles, no, which made it so that I couldn't, I couldn't end the live stream. So I had to have my sister come down and try to help me figure it out. But we just couldn't get it to stop because my the computer overheated, so the YouTube live thing went away, but it was still going live. So my face showing was an accident. I didn't mean to show my face, but there were only like three people that watched the stream or something. Anyways, yeah, that's the message, and let's start the video. it's me kenny can in today's video this plane is glued together made glued by super glue so today we're going to try to smash it and see if we can smash it so yeah i do want to remove this these wheels because once i smash this it's not going to be rebuildable and since you know since it's like that you might be wondering then why are you smashing it because I absolutely hate this plane. For number one, mainly because the plane is terrible, not gonna lie. So it was $60 and it just wouldn't stay together. It was a total ripoff. So yeah, I had to glue it together. Couldn't glue the whole thing, it bothers me so much. So yeah, there's more reasons about that. So I'm not gonna go through every reason why I don't like this plane, but in this video, we're gonna see how long, it, how much smashes it takes to smash it. I believe that some of the pieces are not super glued. Like this one's a replacement, gonna come with this too. But yeah, I, I don't know if all of them are super glued. I built this like a while ago, so yeah, I'm not sure about that. So what we're gonna do, we are gonna try different methods to smash it. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna like first. We're gonna put it on the ground. No, we're not. Okay, never mind. I'm losing my mind. Hold on. Yeah, I'm not doing the crash in the dirt right now. Cause, um, the dirt, no, not the dirt right now. Just cause of reasons that I'm not gonna say. Plus I got my address on the trash can, so I don't wanna put that. All right, here we go. Oh, that's my dog. Hi, Puddles. And, all right, here we go. You know, this video is going to be, well, I hope it doesn't completely smash the first time, the first method, or else this video is going to be bad. Let me just see right here. Let me see real quick. No, all right. Just trying to see where I'm going to crash it. Yeah, right there. All right. All right. Three. Looks 
like the roof is not super glued. I mean, the cockpit roof. It doesn't look like this piece is super glued, so I say this method doesn't work. All right, we've got our next system here. Don't mind the humming. I'm right next to the air conditioners. But here we are, we're gonna smash the plane against the wall about here maybe, I don't know. Where is it? Is that where it goes? All right. Here, all right. You guys ready? We're gonna throw the plane against the wall. Should we do nose first or tail first? Let's do tail first, I guess. Cause um, the nose is kind of gone. Ready? Three, two, oh God, one. That was um a little anticlimactic, I'll say. Um, the nose of the plane is completely gone. Even though, I don't know, I, I believe it hit like this or something like that. I don't know, man. So, yeah. But it's kind of like, it's kind of like that, those flights where like, I don't remember the flight number, but the flight that like a bomb went off and then the plane just kept going up even though the nose was gone. Yeah, um, okay. Alright, the next method is the bouncing trampoline. As you can see, we have the nose gone. Here's the nose. Alright, let's go bounce it on the trampoline. Well, I don't know why I thought that would work. There is literally no damage. It's the exact same. This method does not work. I do want to say that I do get a lot of comments saying, touch grass if you have a life. Literally, first of all, I'm not a gaming channel. Second of all, I live in a desert. Tell me where grass grows in the desert, man. Now we're going to drop a rock on it. Or in our case, a broken tile. I have a feeling this is going to destroy a big chunk of it. Oh god. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Super glue, no damage. One piece came off and this piece was not even glued. All right, we're gonna do another attempt. You guys see it? There we go. Now, drop the rock on it. Three, two, one. Oh yeah. There we go, we got a big chunk of it. Wow. Two pieces to break, cause it's kind of just in the same chunk. So, um, on to the next method. The next method is the pressure test. I'm gonna put the chunk here. And now, oh my god, that's I'm gonna put a brick right here and push it down. Oh, I hear some cracking. Oh, we need more pressure. All right, let's see what we got. All right. Ugh. All right. Push it down. Oh my God! If this was a normal plane, it would have smashed. All right. All right. I don't even need to test it anymore. Um, this method doesn't work. So um, on to the next method. Next method is to soak it in water. Good news, it looks like it's floating. 
That's not good. There's a plate on top of it and we'll come back to it at the end of this video. If I'm being honest with you guys, I, I planned this video like a week ago and I didn't think I'd have this much fun making it. And I just want to say thank you to all my supporters for getting me this far. <laughs> This is the spot where I did Lego Plane Crash 1. Maybe this spot will be good for this plane. Three. Oh, I feel some parts already coming off. Oh, God. All right. Three, two, one. All right. All right. That was decent. No, that was not decent. All right. Next method. This next method is called... How many bricks does it take to smash an airplane? All right, here we go. First, we're gonna start off with this. All right, it's gonna go on. All right, there's the first one. Alright, well that was not really a good montage, but um, we still got another one to break. Honestly, I don't think this method would... I doubt this thing worked. No, didn't work at all. I guess um, there's that we can drain the water. All right, or right, we have to find another way to break this. I've kind of run out of ways to break this, but um, my sister recommended that I smash it against the wall. I know I already did that, but I didn't even try. I just went against the wall and now we're gonna throw it against the wall really hard three oh god I hope it doesn't go over the fence three two one all right thank you laser girl but now we still have a little bit left <laughs> But before I end this video, I do want to say that I have two more LEGO Plane Crash videos coming out. And then, that is it. I will continue the series someday, but for now, there's two left, and the series is done for now. So I want to say thank you all for watching. And I do also want to say that the last Plane Crash video will be, upload will be uploaded to YouTube on July 30th of this year, which means this month. So thank you to all the support. I do also want to mention that I will still be making, I'll still be making Lego airplane videos, just not the crash videos. So thank you all much for watching. And I will give shout outs to my biggest fans once 
the last video comes out. Especially to my biggest fan. I will see you later. Goodbye. And with that, the 2023 season comes to an end. Good night.